And at the Rush Center today, State Girls High School Volleyball action continues. Lords Academy in the hunt for gold in D4 this morning. Here's the hardware at stake, and it was bananas and a lot of jumping around today. After dropping the first set, the Knights rallied and won the second set. A block party here wins game two, 27-25. But their effort wasn't enough. Clayton won the match 3-1. Lords Academy, though, is the Division Four state runner-up. A huge win for a young team hungry to be right back at the Resh next year. We came in here knowing that this was going to be um, a tough match for us today. Um, we kind of looked at it as playing ourselves. Um, Clayton's a strong team, so... We knew that it was going to be a tough battle. Um, we took ourselves out with a few errors, um, but for the most part, this team has played awesome all season. Um, and I wouldn't rather be here with a different group of girls than what we have. Well, this has been like a dream, obviously, state championship. And coming into this tournament and being able to get to the championship with all these girls, it's so super exciting having the experience with every single girl on this team. It was so much fun. Knowing that we have two of the silver balls and being as young as the team we are, we're all really going to work hard next season to really strive for that gold ball. Division two girls volleyball, a battle between some ancient gladiators, the Spartans of Luxembourg Casco taking on the Lakeside Lutheran Warriors for the championship. First frame set point, Peyton Vandenbush puts it through the block. 25-19, Luxembourg Casco takes the opener. Then in the second, more solid play from the Spartans, this time getting it done with defense. Cassie Schiltz, she's pretty tall. She gets the block. Casco wins the opening two sets. But this one destined for five. Lakeside getting stronger as the match wears on. Amber Rowalt, and that's all she wrote. Lakeside Lutheran storms back to win three games to two. A tough loss for Luxembourg Casco, but a historic run for this group of girls. It's undescribable, I guess, because you, you can't prepare yourself for, for the atmosphere and how it's going to be in the gym. And I mean, we thought it was intense in there yesterday, but you come into it today and it's just a completely different ball game. The experience was great. Um, I've never had an experience like this in volleyball before, and I'm just glad that I got to do it with my best friends.